And the big night has arrived. Millions of viewers from around the world are tuning in for the UEFA Europa League final. My name is Derek Ray. My co-commentator to help describe all the action is the former Arsenal and West Ham player Stuart Robson. And with the atmosphere building to fever pitch, we're just minutes away from kickoff time here. It's Inter up against Manchester United. Well, Derek, this should be a top-class game between two excellent teams. Whoever gets control of that midfield area should win the game. But I think this is too close to call. Martinez. Perisic. Martinez. Well, nothing comes of it. Well, he's lost it. Bruno Fernandes. United might be able to cash in. Well, he certainly wasn't offside by a mile. Lukaku. The ball with Martinez. Pass after pass, keeping their opponents moving. It's a neat move. Cuts it back. Well, there's a keeper on song. Well, how did he stop that? That's just unbelievable. Who can he pick out? Cleared away comprehensively. Well, fine hold-up play here. Thumps clear. Dumfries. Here's Ronaldo. Bruno Fernandes vital interception the danger was very real Barella it's with Robin Gosens now what can Inter do from this position still level here but the pressure escalating but then the one that fails to hit its target Space to exploit, maybe. De Jong. Ronaldo. Ronaldo untidy with the ball. Chalanoru. Really getting stuck in. Cristiano Ronaldo. It's now with Van der Beek. Bruno Fernandes. Real defensive commitment there. Well, as the stats show us, this has been a really even game so far. There just hasn't been enough guile or invention in the top third of the field from either team, which needs to change at some point. Able to skip past his man. And a textbook interception. Well, what can they do to stop him running at them? But they dealt with the threat first. And running it back. Bruno Fernandes. And it's with Dumfries. 
Pau Torres. Here's Ronaldo. Now the managers will now deliver their half-time team talks. We're at the end of 45 minutes in this game. The quest for Europa League success and the second half of this final is underway. Martinez. Good work to win the ball back by United. De Jong. Here's Ronaldo. Promising looking ball. Bruno Fernandes. A promising looking attack but comes to nothing in the end could be a chance to break here Perisic went in strongly to win the ball good looking sequence great strong tackle throw in forthcoming Here's a change for Manchester United. Options in the centre. Frankie de Jong. Ronaldo. Jadon Sancho. An alert piece of defending. This might be ideal for the counter. Brozovic. It's with Chalhanolu. Happy to pass the ball, but remaining patient. It's always likely to be the goalkeeper's ball. been given away by Lukaku possession changing hands Marcus Rashford Bruno Fernandes here's Ronaldo and the bank moving the ball effectively looking for the right moment Ronaldo for the grateful arms of Handanovic. And scope for them to produce something exciting. Rashford. Rashford. Ronaldo. And he stopped them just when they looked menacing. Barella. This might be the perfect counter attacking opportunity. Martinez. Oh, moving it nicely. The cutback. Oh, yes! The goal that might well be decisive. The goal that could give them the trophy. Well, here's the replay. He's done really well to get his head up and pick somebody out with that cutback. But you do have to ask questions of the keeper. Could he have done better here? I think so. You can't be beaten at your near post like that. Dramatic moment near the end, and that might well be the decider.
De Jong. Bruno Fernandes has it. Well, with five minutes remaining and just one goal between them, still the prospect of late excitement in this match. They've decided that now is the time to go to the bench. Well, very late in the contest, and it's Inter holding a marginal lead. Stuart, interested in your thoughts on their overall performance? Yeah, just about edging it overall. It's been a really tight game, hasn't it? Chances at a premium, and you have to praise their defending in that regard. Just got to see out the final few minutes now. No silly mistakes at the back. Nicely timed tackle. And the counter looks on here. Options available. What about the stoppage time situation? Two minutes the word. So it's going to be a goal kick here. And there's the whistle. This UEFA Europa League final has been decided. And my goodness, they deserve it.